This is the microchip that could one day be implanted under the skin of every single American. We have a Florida family who are really pioneers in a brave new world. They have volunteered to be the first ever to have microchip identification devices implanted into their body. After 9-11, I was really concerned um, with the security of my family. Top CFR Lieutenant Diane Sawyer for eight minutes sat there in a sickening fashion with this poor, pathetic family as they discussed how they were all taking microchips because they believed in America and wanted to stop the terrorist. Ladies and gentlemen, this is something out of a science fiction horror movie. They're taking chips because they stand with the mother government. I'm living in Nazi Germany Twilight Zone. Now politicians are announcing that they want to get chipped. Something has to change, though. They have to find a better way to identify the bad guys, or the rest of us are going to stay home and watch the world go by on television. But we need some system for permanently identifying safe people. Most of us are never going to blow anything up, and there's got to be something better than one of these photo IDs, a tattoo somewhere, maybe. The Saudis used an American device to scan the eyes of travelers. I wouldn't mind having something planted permanently in my arm. That would identify me. If we don't do something, people are going to stop flying. If they stop flying and I don't go to the Giants games, it means the bastards have won. And we're not going to let you win, buddy. We saw what you just implied. We're with Al Qaeda if we don't take the microchip. Do you know how to keep your children safe? We'll tell you tonight. In the next year, you'll be able to use your teen's cell phone to locate them 24-7. Younger children will get a small global positioning device hidden in their wristwatch or backpack. And just around the next high-tech corner, an electronic chip like this that can be implanted under your kid's skin. Let's say children in your community start wearing wristwatches with GPS devices in them. Can't that only be a good thing for the community if it keeps children safe? The implant microchip will store data information such as fingerprint, footprint, eye scan, DNA genotype, financial status, and personal history. No one will be able to buy or sell without it. One will identify the individual with the mark. Oh yes, the ID card will also be coded with numbers. And the number is... 600, 3 score, and 6. And he causeth all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads, and that no man might buy or sell, save he that had the mark, or the name of the beast, or the number of his name. Here is wisdom. Let him that hath understanding count the number of the beast for it is the number of a man and his number is six hundred three score and six